If there's one thing that Tesla has yet to accomplish in their dream of making electric cars and, well, their own brand, the standard for everyone who considers owning a vehicle, it is their prices. And although the Model 3 from a couple of years ago finally brought the car from the stratosphere into the actually available for more people realm at $35,000, for anyone who's not a middle class American, that is still pretty substantial. But just because he hasn't done it yet, don't think that our boy Elon doesn't have a plan for everything. And since his dream especially rests on widespread electric car usage, you can be sure that Tesla is just getting started, and we might know the biggest strategy yet. Today, we're discussing Tesla's plans to unveil a revolutionary new car, one that has been referred to as the Model 2. Although the exact details are a little fuzzy, we have plenty of stuff to go on to see what exactly those guys over at Tesla are up to. So to learn more about this alleged model, what it'll be like, how they'll design it, and most importantly, what it means for Tesla as well as electric cars in general, keep watching this video. 1. The Name Now, before all of you get confused with the naming scheme with the new car being Model 2 while the Model 3 has been out for nearly four years now, let's clear up one thing first. The Model 2 is not the official name. In fact, it's the working title, or code name, that Tesla employees use when referring to the project. Now, it very well might be what the company ends up calling the car when it gets released, but until then, we can't really be sure. After all, with the Model S, Model 3, written as three dashes like an E, and Model X all forming a very clear image in our heads, we should be prepared for anything and everything when it comes to Elon naming stuff. Two. What is it? Now here's what we know about all this. Tesla has for quite some time wanted to release a small form factor low cost vehicle that'll be their proper entry into the low cost market. Because the simple fact is, although there are profits to be made at the high end and your brand reputation does depend on your supercars and high luxury SUVs, the actual cars that sell are the Corollas and Ford Focuses of the world. And that's exactly what the company intends this model to be for them. An affordable, easy to drive car that anyone from your grandma to your young cousin can drive. 3. How far it's in development Another thing to note is that although this might come as a surprise to those of you who have stand Tesla for their high speed and futuristic designs, the original goal of the company has always been to develop affordable middle and lower grade vehicles. And so in one way, this is Tesla coming to form as Elon intended it to. Although that may make you think that the car is just ready to come out, well, not just yet. Instead, it is still very much in development. But just how far is the point that varies from person to person. Some people say that the car has already been designed and only the production aspect is left to design and manage, while others claim that it's just a general goal with nothing concrete underneath. Now, the reality of the situation is still comparatively smudged, as Tesla is known for being secretive about such details to avoid competition. But I'm pretty sure, as are many experts, that the car is somewhere in the late development cycle with a lot left to finalize, but the general outline and underlying functions are well established. 4. Where will it be made? Now this might seem like an unimportant thing to mention regarding a car, but in the Model 2's case, it's actually rather important. You see, instead of manufacturing the cars in the states of the factories they already own, where stuff for the Model S, 3, and X are made, along with the upcoming Cybertruck and Roadster 2, Tesla seems to have very specific and separate plans for the Model 2, namely China. It is a well-known fact that mass manufacturing is nowhere easier than in China, and just like Apple, Google, and the rest of the big bunch, Tesla seems to have taken a liking to the country as well, because they've acquired an entire plant in Shanghai by the name of Gigafactory Shanghai just to manufacture the Model 2. And that makes sense in a bunch of different ways. A. It'll make the cost a lot less compared to if they sold it as is. And B. China is kind of the world's smart car center. And with Chinese manufacturing, their goals of making a steady supply of cheap, quality electric vehicles might be a possibility. 5. What is the timeline? Now that we know what it is and how they plan to make it, let's focus on the details that the company and Elon have revealed. The story begins last year, when Tesla announced that they had plans to establish a new R&D center in China to develop and later manufacture a Chinese-style electric car. Quite soon, designs began to be drafted and submitted until summer last year, after which the company even started hiring for the program. And all along, we got several mock-ups and sketches as to what the car may look like. 
Even more recently, there have been several media reports coming out of China that claim the production of the Model 2 could start very soon. However, confirmation is still lacking and we don't think there's too much merit in that. One thing that has been confirmed, however, is the price and direction, which, as we revealed, will be lower mid-range both in cost and design. In a company-wide meeting held recently, the CEO revealed that Tesla was aiming to start production of the new $25,000 car in 2023. 6. What will power it? Now, one of the biggest factors as to how the company will manufacture such absurdly cheap cars is not just based around China, but another thing. Namely, the new 4680 cells will impact it too. Unlike older battery packs, which use strips of metal to connect an array of cells, the company seeks to remove the multiple pieces of conductor that connect a cell to others by a far more efficient material. And this battery is a direct result of that. Along with that, we have a larger physical size specialized for recharging and an entirely new factory dedicated to manufacturing just batteries. As a result, we get a promised 10% increase in charging times and add to that 16% in range and 5 to 6 times increase in power and energy. So you can see why the company is so eager to put these into their Hail Mary car. 7. What it'll look like. Now we understand that the company is still deeply secretive about the details of this car. Fans, however, have had some luck in the visual department, specifically in the form of an official sketch that allegedly is of the upcoming car. As the image reveals, the futuristic design is very reminiscent of the Model 3, the company's other small volume and cost vehicle, leading many to believe that this might become an entire line of vehicles in time. All in all, it'll be a small hatchback probably around the size of a Ford Focus, with Tesla's usual futuristic flair. 8. What the interior will look like The interior of most cars might not be the most important thing for many people. After all, aren't all cheap car interiors basically the same? Well, as it turns out, the interior is the single biggest piece of news out there. So what astounding new feature will be seen in this car of dreams? Well, as it turns out, it's the lack of features that will determine the wow factor of the car. Because according to Elon himself in the aforementioned conference, the car will feature as an effort from Tesla towards achieving a deployable full self-driving system. Musk even asked Tesla employees, do we want to have this car come with a steering wheel and pedals? And if you look back into the company history, there's definitely precedent for that. As early as 2019, Tesla has revealed their plans for self-driving fleets and even unveiled an image of a vehicle without a steering wheel and pedals, and went on to say that they wanted to make it within two years. And with the version 10.1 of Tesla's autopilot system on the way, it's not a stretch to say that the first instance of a completely autonomous car might be the Model 2. So the future nerds can hold on to that. 9. When will it come out? Last but not least, the release date. Well, according to sources from the Tesla company meeting, the company plans to start production on a $25,000 car by 2023. And by all accounts, this is what the Model 2 will be. And so, if everything goes according to plan, you can expect to see them on the road by 2024. And that, my friends, covers all that we know about the Model 2. Sure, there are a lot of ambiguities, but this should give you some idea of this car of the future. With that, it's time to wrap up. Thank you so much for watching. Leave a like if you enjoyed the video, and I'll see you next time.